So welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Last time, we did some miscellaneous stuff and killed a phantom as Ezio. And then we uh, reawakened right, uh, right back to Monterigioni in the present day. And somehow found Mario's sword, which I looked off screen just to see where the hell it was. It was standing in a bush. Yeah, I don't know how I didn't even see that, but it was dark. Come on, I was looking in eagle vision, but anyway. This time... Head back into the Animus. It's ready for you. Right back to where we... Oh, wow. It's literally right where we left off here, too. So we do have three options of our main missions. We are going to be doing main missions right now. Uh, although there is a port... No, no. I will take this viewpoint just so I can see a little better, but... Now nah, we'll save the, at the very least we'll save the Borgia Tower for later in the episode, not right now. So, also I'm pretty sure we are not supposed to get that one tower, but technically you can do these at any point you want. I think some of these uh, captains you have to wait at a specific time, which is really annoying. I did not know there was a hay bale there. Speaking of hay bales, one of the things I wanted to mention that not a lot of people know about for some reason... Anywhere you see- Oh, no, no, get away from me, ukulele man, or whatever the crap that is. I do not want to stab somebody today. Or at least not any innocent people today. If you see any areas where there's, like, pigeon poop on the side of the rooftop or whatever, or you just see a bunch of pigeons, usually that means that is a safe place to jump off of. So, keep that in mind. Uh, can I get on top of this? I don't- Uh, maybe. Maybe? No. No. Did I do this for no reason? I might have done this for no reason. That would really su I mean, I can go inside. Can't I? I can. Uh, I mean, I know this place is used for later, but... Uh, okay, everybody just <laughs> respawned. Uh, I want to try to get this viewpoint if I can. I don't know if it'll let me... Oh, there's a vantage point right here. Uh, oh, God. Oh, oh. Sorry, I'm just trying to make my way through. There's important pigeons I need to meet. Okay, uh, this is where we have to start. Okay. Let's hop on top. Of okay, really, dude? Hop up here. This is really complicated to get through, but... Then again, there's only like 20 or so viewpoints, so I'm not really going to complain too much if they're elaborate to get to. Again, uh, okay, Ezio, please, stand on top of thing and walk. Jesus. <laughs> And just hop up here. Now we should be able to make our way to the very top, hopefully. Can I hop onto this? No, I can't. Okay. Around we go, then. I think. Maybe. I mean, this has to be where we have to go, because this is way too obvious. I did not mean to spend, like, the first five minutes just trying to get to a viewpoint, but damn it, I am determined at this point. We will be doing story missions today, because I didn't do any last episode, so... <laughs> I do promise you that, at the very least. All right, let's just keep, keep going, Ezio. You have more places to trek through. God, why is this so elaborate to get to? Like, Jesus, I can drop down here at least. Walk around. Uh, there's a bird feather on the cross. Jesus was a bird, I guess. Eh, whatever. <laughs> Not gonna look too far into that. Is that our viewpoint? Yes, it is. Thank God. Synchronize. Very, very cool. Rome is so pretty. Seriously. Up did not mean to do that. Okay. And leap of faith. We love it. So yeah, we can choose any of the three missions right now. We'll have to do uh, do them all eventually. So I think I'm going to focus on the one on this side of the map. So let us head on over there hey. real quick. Now in between these missions, I will cut to uh, get to specific spots. So... Do keep that in mind, but... Oh, oh God. Just, but for right now, we'll just book it, because it's right here, so... Not that bad of a trek. I could call my horse, but honestly, I think the horse is more bad when it comes to reliability, because if you knock into a guard, they don't like it, and they'll try to stab your face off, so... I'd just rather not. Uh, Okay, since I'm here, there's a blacksmith right here that I have not bought. Actually, have I bought this? I don't see how I didn't buy this. I didn't buy this. I bought the medical clinic right beside it, but not this. Maybe that's just a side doctor, maybe? Whatever. Might as well buy this now. We're right here. 
convenient. Alright, oh, oh god. The camera does not like it when you do that. Anyway, just hop down here. Uh, okay. Sup, bro? Lots of horses here. Lots of horses in Rome for some reason. To this very big building. Welcome to the Rosa in Fiore, stranger. Salve. Would you be kind enough to call the owner for me? Madonna Solari is not in. Do you know where she is? I... Aiuto! Aiuto! Madonna Solari! A Lucia! We thought you were gone for good. The men took us on a ship. And they released me, but she... Who took you on a ship? Slave traders, Messere. Near Isola Tiberina. They want coin in exchange for her life. I will get her back. Ah, high stakes negotiation. Uh, do not swim. I can deal with that. I played PS2 for a very long time. Well, not very long time, actually. Um, okay, what? Oh, I have to gather money, really? All right, time to steal. <laughs> I think I'm about to steal. But yeah, I, I mean, I didn't really play PS2. For, I mean, I played a lot of PS2 games, but then again, I was kind of like, what, five or something like that in the middle of the PS2's life, so... Yeah, not really. Really shows my age, huh? Okay, can I... Is there somebody rich I could steal off of? Like, seriously, this is kind of ridiculous. Yoink. Uh, uh-oh, they did not like that. Run! The guards, no! Oh, uh, why is there so many? Why is there always so many? Okay, run, run. Uh, dude, jackass on the horse, move. Okay. Uh, okay, now there's two of them. Dodge the horses and jump up here. Huh. They'll never find me up here. Crap, they found me. All right. <laughs> we'll go over here and uh, hide with these guys. Hey, friends. I really need to sit down. They'll never find me. They'll never distinguish me between these two people. The guy that kind of looks like Robert Downey Jr. and the other guy who's just kind of homeless. Man, why are you so red? Your face is super red, but you're... Okay, whatever. That was weird. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Get, get off the bench. I know you really like the bench, but... God, I really need that much money. It's probably better just to kill the guards and get the money that way, but it wants me to steal. All right, get more money. That, God, you are not, no, jeez. Oh, Olga there did not look very uh, appealing, let's just say that much. Okay, uh, is that, that's not a guard. Okay, good. Hello, friends. Nice little group you got here. This is gonna take forever, holy crap. Man, I, can't, I really just can't murder somebody and get a bunch of money that way, huh? It's probably my fault for buying that blacksmith shop <laughs> right right before doing this, because I probably would have had enough. Uh, whatever. I think I'm just probably going to... I don't know. Okay, here's what I want to test. Let's murder some of these guards. Oh, oh God. Uh, sir. Okay. Let's murder these guards, like, right here. And then uh, see how much they... Up oh, okay. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Damn! Okay, bros. Bring it. Bring it. Yoink. Okay. Should only take just a couple of you guys. Don't worry about it. Uh, those guards, I hope, don't come nearby and see me looting dead corpses. 28 bucks. Uh, I mean, I did not want to pick this up, but okay, whatever. All right. Hello, friends. I want your money. Man, this is really high stake, high reward, huh? All right. Thank you for your contributions. Now <laughs> everyone's just panicking. <sighs> yeah, this is really not that much better, huh? I mean, I get some extra stuff, I guess, even though I can't hold it. Oh, this guy's not even dead. Can I kill you? Oh, oh okay. Not. I did not mean to do that. Sorry, friend. Oh, my God. All right. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Everybody. Oh, Jesus. There's so many people. Oh, well, hello. Uh, give me your money. I need your money. Thank you, friend. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe these higher up guards give more money. 22 bucks. They got an extra $10 raise. Okay. I murdered enough people. That, God, this is going to take forever. Really? All right. I'm just going to cut ahead until I get the money I need because this is kind of ridiculous. Unless if I can look for some boxes or something. Maybe that's what I need to do, is just look around for some money boxes. I mean, they're easy to see. Yeah, there's like one right here. Maybe that's what I need to do. Hello, friends. All right. 
Let's see if this counts. I think it's just because I don't have that much money generally. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, that's what it is. Okay. That's way better. And also I get extra items out of it, so. I'm just going to cut ahead to where I get the money that I need for this because this is kind of ridiculous that I need to do. Yeah, so. Ugh. Oh, God. Okay, let me see. Is there a treasure chest, please? Please tell me there's a treasure chest. There's a treasure chest. All right, I'll meet you guys back when I have the money. And got the money I needed. It actually didn't take that long. I, I mean, I was going to go after a whole bunch of money boxes, but I couldn't find any. But the one guy I looted, which I'll show right now, I got like 800 bucks off of him for some reason. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why either. Oh, God. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, keep that in mind. If you're doing this mission, have money on you. That was not very great of a decision. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Eh, whatever. It's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, right. I can't swim. Crap. All right. I have to go. Oh, okay. Okay. Let's go all the way around and cross the bridge like a normal person. That's probably why they don't want me to swim, because it'd be much easier. Uh, I would take that shortcut there, but there's literally a bridge right across from me, so... I'd rather take the safe way out. Now watch, the bridge would just come out from under me or something. Eh, whatever. Uh. So, yeah. This one's really not that bad, though. I mean, it's a short mission. That's why I chose it, but... Hopefully... We'll get more than one mission, because I did not think that I was going to need more money for this. Uh, God, you guys take up so much freaking room. Move. Jesus. Why have this tiny of roads for this many people? My God. All right. Lots of you poor people. Good thing I didn't try to steal money from you. How far away is this place? Like, I am going across a country just for this. I mean, it's not really a country. It's just Rome, but... Might as well be a country, I guess. Okay, really, how how far is this place? Jesus. Okay, we're, we're close. Not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, there's a Borgia Tower right here, though. That's going to be interesting. Or, no. Oh, uh, uh, sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry, friend. I apologize. Oh, there is a Bor uh, Borgia Tower here. Are you here for the whore? Are you dead to me? I have your money. Let her go. No! Take it up with Cesare. So much for negotiations. Give me back my money. Man, that okay, yeah, that guy deserved it. Yoink. Ow. Jackass. Die. And you. And you. All you go down. Yoink. And yoink. Why well, need a better sword when he could just you know, murder them all? Uh well, you had a lot of stuff. Holy crap. Are they all like that? Holy crap, they are. I am looting all of these guys. Damn. They are loaded. I guess that's why you loot them some... I was about to loot the... Uh, the lady. Jeez, yeah, these guys are loaded with money. I will gladly take it. Thank you guys for con contributing towards my war effort. Alright, later. <laughs> I'll take care of that Borgia Tower later. I'm not going to worry about it right now. Yeah, Borgia... Uh, difficulty 4. Yeah, probably not meant for us right now. Hello, friends. I mean, you could put a difficulty number on there, and I won't know what the hell it means. I mean, yeah, one's probably easiest, and then five is probably the hardest, but... I mean, what is the comparison to that? Why is there so many guards around these, like, ruins? What is there to guard? Oh, God, we have to protect these columns. <laughs> like, I guess if they're preserving the historicalness of everything, but... Usually this early on in time, people didn't really care about that. Most people just cared about blowing stuff up. And that's why we do not have a lot of historical accuracy things to this day. Look at you, Tower of Alexandria. Which really sucks, because uh, if you don't know about the Tower of Alexandria, uh, well, I guess in con <laughs> uh, congruence with that, see, look at me in big words, the Library of Alexandria. Which had a lot of knowledge that we completely lost and probably sent us back multiple centuries, so. It's whatever. It was bound to happen, I guess. And yeah, I, keep, I really keep wanting to swim, but I have to remember that I can't. If I swim, we're screwed. I mean, it doesn't end the mission or anything, but I want to keep the 100% if I can, so. 
I like that I've pretty much passed everything except for the very <laughs> the, the very beginning mission where it's supposed to be a tutorial and uh, the Romulus thing, yeah. I never said I was a professional. The only thing I have said is that I'm an LP here. <laughs> and even then, I haven't even said that, I don't think, in any of the LPs, so. Hey, first is the first, right? Anyway, enough of these ramblings. Let's finally head back to the... Th Do I have to, like, jump up? That's probably what it is. Good thing we are a spider monkey. Uh, I say as we get stuck. Spider monkey! Mother? Sister? Ezio. Sir Machiavelli said that you might be here. What are you doing in Roma? Has Firenze been attacked? No. Or rather, I do not know. We did not go to Firenze. Why? Ezio, we want to help. I was trying to help you by sending you to Firenze. Where is Madonna Solari? She's dead. Merda. What now? Will we have to close? You cannot close. I need your help. Messere, without someone who can run things, we're finished. I'll do it. You do not belong here, Claudia. I know how to run a business. I ran Uncle Mario's for years. This is different. What alternative do you have, Ezio? You do this, Claudia. And you are on your own. I've been on my own for 20 years. Fine. I intend to repair the brothel. This place is a real mess. And I want your courtesans to find Katarina Sforza. You can count on us. What this dandy? We have a little family business happening. Oh, oh, sorry, lady. Didn't mean to grab you. That's happening a lot recently. A uh, nice little family business and uh, prostitution. Huh, whatever. Uh, yeah. Repair the Rosa and Fiore. Oh, what is that horse doing? Oh God! Man, they build them like Minecraft, huh? Thanks. Oh, you're talking. You're talking about the building. Welcome to the Rosa in Fiore. As you can see, the most popular brothel in Roma. My money went well invested. Here, I keep a list of the skills taught to my girls. You're not teaching them much. Think you could do better? Nessun problema. Ezio, the Borgia make it difficult for Claudia's girls. There are several things you could do that would aid them. I will keep that in mind. Anything else? No. Ezio. Did you find Katarina? We are working on it. Bene. Come to see me at Isola Tiberina with her location. Man, really running the show, huh? So, this unlocks a whole separate thing with all of the courtesans. Hi, mother. Buongiorno, mother. Ezio. Thank you for coming to see me. What troubles the courtesans? The old proprietor of this brothel, Madonna Solari, was a cheat and liar. Her ties to the church have been uncovered. Worse, several of those who work for us sleep with the enemy still. I will find them. Visit the girls I trust. They will help you. Grazie, Ezio. So yeah. That unlocks a whole giant slew of things with the courtesans. There's a whole, like, little side things you could do, like guards poisoned, killed during a smoke bomb, horses belonging to guards commandeering without killing the rider. Like, dear, there's a lot. There's a lot of things you can do here. So, yeah. Those are guild challenges. They do unlock some things, but for the courtesans, it's really not that imperative but that did bring up a lot of money on the renovation side of things so let's see is there any okay yeah here we go so now we have courtesan assignments which would go do one the courtesan assignments are actually pretty good uh actually is there is that just the label for the rosa and fiore 
Okay, yeah, that is... It, they use the, why do they use the same freaking thing? Anyway. I'm just gonna TP for you guys over there to the mission, so BRB. On over here to our first courtesan assignment. Hello, lady. Ezio, since Madonna Solari's death, her brother Santino claims ownership of us. He struggles to gain Borgia favor and must prove himself leader of the courtesans. Humiliate him in public, and he loses the support of the Borgia. We will not hear from him again. Sounds like a good thing for us. Stop Santino before he beats up the courtesan. I'm not going to promise anything. Beat him up, but do not kill him. Sounds fun. Let's go... <laughs> this is kind of similar to the whole beat-up missions from Assassin's Creed 2. There's a lot of things that they bring over from 2 into Brotherhood, just through a different way. So in this case, the courtesans want you to go and kill or beat the crap out of somebody. So, hey, jackass, don't beat a woman. <laughs> I, I thought I punched her myself. All right, hey, buddy. Actually, can I can I loot you? Hold on, buddy. Can I loot you? I can. How much money you got on you, pal? Eleven dollars. You claim you claim ownership over a bunch of prostitutes, and yet you only have a eleven dollars to your name. Man, you are a sad, sad piece of work. Eh, whatever. Let's go dump you over into this place. Okay, they did not like that. Oh, ow! Okay, I have to be really careful. All right, bros. I'm not here for you. You're just lucky that you're in the way here. Okay. Do not kill the guy next to them. Do not kill the guy next to them. Ow, oh, piss. Alright. Uh, sorry, friend. I had to use the gun on you. I haven't had a lot of opportunities for the gun. Alright. Bloop. This man is a worthless liar. The courtesans of Roma will never answer to him. Well, that was easy. Can I dump him? I wanted to dump him into the river. So yeah, also these heartbreak missions over here, which is called a Christina mission. Those are, wait, what is this? Copernico. What? Okay, I don't know what that is, but this is something we will be doing later. But just keep in mind that uh, we're probably not going to be messing with that right now. Um, I want to see quickly if we can take down another Borgia Tower, so... Let's see if we could go and do that since we're running out of time here. I mean, we got like five minutes in the episode, at least on my side, but as I said, I'm going to try to keep these around 20 to 30 minutes. If we go like mid 30s, it's not that big of a deal, but that's probably going to be the maximum that I'll handle for these videos because I do not want them going overboard. So anyway, let's go see if I can do this. There are kind of, uh, can I, oh, I'm not going to be able to call it crap. All right, I have to go around. Damn it. It's just... Anyway, so yeah, these Borgia Towers do have varying difficulty. What is this one? If it tells me. Is it going to tell me? This is a five. Ooh, okay. This is going to be interesting. Probably have all the things to our abilities that we can kill him outright, maybe. If I could just get to him, then I think would be good. Uh, nobody on the rooftops. That's a good start. Uh, are we already behind him? God, I don't want to drop all the way down because I don't know. He, I don't know if this guy's a runner. Okay, that's the item I'm hearing. Okay. Um, there are guards here. Okay, one potential idea I have is just just is just to blitz in there and stab him. I think that's the only option I'm gonna get. Okay, let's try that. So, let's get the hidden blade. Ah, he's right beside the damn door. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Oh, he has more guards than I thought. Okay. This is gonna be awkward. I don't have anything I could really do, huh? I don't have poison. I do have poison, but I have to go up there and stab him with it, though. Crap. Oh, wait, he's moving. Again, I don't know if he's going to run inside. That's the thing. Oh, come on, man. They ain't going to budge. All right, here's our best window. I think I'm going to just run in there, shove everybody away so that I can try to stab him on the ground. 
Let's do it. Sup, jackass? Yeah, got him! And they all run away because they're scared because they lost their leader. I got really lucky. <laughs> Man, these have been going really well. Also, he had almost a thousand bucks on his name. Cool. All right, that worked out beautifully. I think, yeah, he was a runner, so he would have ran to the nearest uh, doorway. Because if they run inside of a building, you have to wait for them to respawn. And it sucks, and it's annoying, and I don't like it, so... Anyhow, this is not going to get us anywhere. Uh, crap. See, the only thing I'm worried about is that some of these may require us to have a better jump ability, which I don't know if that's the case, because technically you can do all of these, I think, without special abilities. Uh, can I? Okay, there we go. I was going to say, if I couldn't jump up that. Okay, yeah, no, we can easily climb this. Cool. They probably got rid of that requirement and just made the jump climb ability just... Okay, I swear you could do it. Yeah, no, I can't do it. For some reason, Ezio has dementia and just does not remember how to do a simple jump up and grab. Eh, whatever. All right, let's climb up here. Not too shabby. I'm surprised that plan worked. Another one goes into Sidhu's. Easy money. Not too bad. Oh, uh, hey, there's a thief here. Hey, buddy. Where, where the, oh, he climbed the ladder. Hey, all right. I want your money. <laughs> I want to, see, I want to get vengeance on the person who stole, uh, or, yeah, crap. Okay, I'm trying to run after this guy and say the joke that I'm trying to say. I want to steal the money that you just stole from an innocent bystander. Get over here, jackass. Not purely for the sake of reputation, but purely, purely just to make me better at renovating buildings. I really want your money. Uh, Jesus, you are fast. Like, dear God. Oh, oh thanks for coming to me. Uh, where are you going? Uh, but, but, uh, uh, okay. Where, where, where is he? There he is. Run, 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 run. Don't climb that. If you climb that, you're an asshole. Don't climb that. No, oh my God. Dude, get back here. Jesus. I'm faster than you. Thank you. All right, now die. Because that, that, all that did was waste my time. Okay. Last things before we uh, end things off here. I'm going to go buy this uh, bank over here. because Ow, I am taking a lot of damage. Yeah, I'm going to go buy this bank real quick so that I can <laughs> withdraw the money that I got from those uh, 20 minutes. Increase to 2400 bucks. Lots of money rolling in. Sup, buddy? Give me the money. Also, there is no consequence if you hold all your money on you. So, and I'm pretty sure you hold an infinite amount, or at least up to like nine, 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 whatever. So, uh, since we're right here, I'll as well just go and buy this. Yeah, you can tell how uh, squirrel-brained I get when I just see a bunch of non-bought non buildings. And it's like, well, I want to buy it. Yeah, die clothes or whatever. All right, cool. Anyway. That is where I'm going to end things off for this one. So, next time on Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, we're going to not look at uh, Poseidon's butt cheeks. Yeah, I don't know why that's there anyway. We'll be going and checking around some more friends we can meet throughout the city. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. <laughs>